First Coast News is Robert Bradfield here and wanted to show you Jack's Beach right now and what it looks like, but there's still several people that are here looking at the waves. There's a couple surfers that we saw earlier here as well. Also want to introduce you to my new friend. You're out here looking at the waves. Why, yeah. why, why come out here? To look at the waves. To look at the waves. To look at the waves and all the surfers. And all the surfers. <laughs> uh -huh. And your thoughts of these surfers, are they crazy or what? They are crazy. They are crazy. They are crazy, but like I said, they want to see these Hawaii waves when they can. Yeah, and we don't. It's, it's, it's they're daring. Yeah, they are daring. Uh -huh. uh, but you said you're you're out here really just for a quick four minutes or so. Yeah, that's what she allowed me. My daughter really? allowed me four minutes. Is your four minutes up? <laughs> it was a while back. It was a while back, but you're still here. <laughs> yes, I am. All it's right. amazing. I love the water. And your first name? Betty. Betty. Nice meeting you. Nice Robert meeting with you. First Coast News. Thank, Thank you very you, much Robert. for your time. Again, just a couple people here on Jack's Beach. That's probably an understatement here. But again, many people, even though the beaches are closed, they're asking people to stay out of the water. But again, there are several people here that are looking at these waves. And we will keep you updated on our coverage on air and online. In Jack's Beach, I'm Robert Bradfield, First Coast News.